everyone, Georgetown Soaps. I just got my April mystery box from Be Scented, so I'm super excited to open it up and see what's in it. Um, the concept is it's just a box full of little samples and mystery gifts. You don't necessarily know what's going to be in it. Ooh. Needed some more Tuss of Silk. That always comes in handy. Can never have enough spatulas. Got a little SLSA, use that for the bath bombs, so that's always handy. Uh, the red rocket jojoba beads, those are, look like fun. Have to find something to put those in. Some colloidal oatmeal, a little sample. And look at how cute this little bag of cocoa butter is. Super, super cute. I always use the natural, and this is the refined and deodorized, so it's ultra white, so I'm excited to try something new. Some rose, kale, and clay. I always see a lot of people using it. I've just never um, <coughs> used it. So it always comes out really pretty in soaps. So I will look forward to trying that. This is one of the puffer sprayers. Um, I guess you could, you put glitter and you can put micas in it and then you can spray it out on to your soaps and your bath bombs and all that. Super excited. That will come in handy. Um, this is another version of this but it's a puffer bottle. This I believe you can use mica in it. This one I believe it's only glitter. Um, this kind of fine sprays everything and this one is just more for the glitter. And then this must be the world's tiniest little funnel. Help you get the glitter into the puffer sprayer bottles. And then two fragrance samples. These are actually two of my favorites. Um, this is Sweet Berry Licious by Bath & Body Works. Smells fantastic. Um, I actually do need to do some soaps in that, so that was a good reminder. And then Forever Red, I just did, gosh, probably 30 pounds of Forever Red the other day, so I don't necessarily need more of that. <laughs> um, got some red glitter. I see the theme of this is probably red and all reds and pinks, so that's cute. And then it looks like this is a little tester of cranberry butter. I've never had this before. Super cute jar. And I don't think I'm strong enough to get it open. Ah, there we go. Actually smells a little bit like cranberry. It's super cute. Um, so I'm I'm actually just gonna try some, you know, it's probably a little cold from sitting. Wow, it goes on really smooth. Um, it just kind of does melt into your hand. It's super cute might just keep this in my little purse as a tr tester, travel size. Uh, these are, it looks like these are the two new beaker cups that Bee Scented has. Um, they are about three and a half fluid ounces, um, so they're perfect size for measuring out your fragrance oils. I'm always stuck, <coughs> I kind of use these sizes, but obviously I don't need that much. Um, so it's always nice. These are, um, I'm sure they are fragrance safe, so super cute. See, just to give you an example of how big they are, that's the two ounce bottle in there. So, perfect size, love those. Love, my new favorite color, I'm almost out. This is the Red High Heels Mica. Um, this is the red, it looks really pink in the bag, so it's super deceiving, but when you open it up, it's red, so I don't know what the plastic bags do to it, but super, super cute. Um, this is the Deep Rose Mica. Again, I love this color. I use it a lot, so I'm glad I got another bag of that. Uh, the rosebud is super nice color. It's like a pink slash um, purple, so it's got a little bit purple tint to it. So it's not quite pink, and it's not quite red, and it's not quite purple. I'd say it's a little bit on the purple side, but very, very pretty color. Um, I actually am going to make some lilac, so I might actually try and use the rosebud. And then everyone's favorite, red raspberry. This is one of my go-to's. Super, super pretty color. So just so you can see the colors next to each other. There you go. Well, this is pretty exciting. Um, got a lot of stuff I can use and actually play with. Um, who doesn't need colloidal oatmeal? Another spatula is always handy. Love this little cute bag of the cocoa butter. Super, super cute. Nice little sample. Um, and I did need some more Tessa Silk, so super excited about that. Um, I think I'm most excited maybe about this cranberry butter. 
cranberry butter, these little pitchers. You can never have enough little cups when you're making a whole bunch of batches. Um, and the glitter puffer sprayer bottle. Uh, I'm actually, I'm getting ready to make some lilac soap. So I think I'll go grab my purple glitter and throw this in there. So anyway, thanks for watching the unboxing. Super excited. Um, I believe if you want to order the next month's box, they're going to ship at the end of May. So you can go ahead and pre-order. I know she only does a limited supply just because she's got to kind of get the ingredients or ingredients, all of the supplies ordered ahead of time. So, <laughs> excuse me. So if you're interested in getting a box, um, I would go over to bescented.com and you can pre-order it. Um, they ship the end of the month and I'm excited to see what next month's theme was. Obviously this was red and a little bit of pink. So very, very cool. Thanks so much. Have a great day.